Hi, I'm Robert Osborne. Welcome. Nice to have you with us. We're going to bring you some films directed by a much admired director from the 1950s, Jack Arnold. Someone known for ably tackling almost every movie genre around, but especially westerns and sci-fi adventures. Well, our first movie is called No Name on the Bullet, a western that came out in 1959. Jack Arnold actually began his career many years before that as a dancer in vaudeville back in the 1920s, later moving on to the Broadway stage. And while he was on Broadway, he would shoot highlights of the shows on 16mm film and sell that footage to other actors in the company at a big markup, teaching himself the basics of filmmaking in the process. All this happened before unions, of course, stepped in and outlawed that sort of thing happening, at least officially. Anyway, during World War II, Jack Arnold joined the Signal Corps as a cameraman and worked under the great documentary filmmaker Robert Flaherty. After the war, Arnold continued making films, including a documentary called With These Hands, which was nominated for an Academy Award as the best documentary of 1950. Soon after that, Universal International signed him to a contract, and it's at that studio where he directed our next film. No Name on the Bullet is a Western with psychological undertones. Audie Murphy stars in it as a hired gun who rides into a small town looking for the person he's supposed to kill. But no one in town knows who that person is. But having the gunfighter in town causes suspicion and paranoia everywhere. Meanwhile, the hired gun just sits and waits. Here's a film also starring Samuel Goldwyn's discovery, Joan Evans. From 1959, No Name on the Bullet.